see it is successfully moving forward and I want to thank each and every one of y'all for that showing me the love and support getting me out there leaving a positive comments it's almost at uh, 100 subscribers coming in there and oh man looking good guys compared to four months ago I started the YouTubing and man if anybody tell you that YouTubing ain't a job it ain't work man they are crazy it's a lot of hard work a lot of time you put in but at the same time I love what I do I love enjoying everything I do out there finding new places exploring new places trying something different cooking something different and guy like I say without y'all it would be nothing going on with the channel but so I thank y'all for everything y'all are doing and did hitting that like and subscribe button you know it's moving slowly but it's moving and all because of y'all so y'all ain't subscribed yet you ain't like the channel yet or you watch the video or you click on it that home screen you see that little like and subscribe symbol hey y'all smash it baby smash it for me and i thank y'all and it's growing and i couldn't do it without y'all so like i say i'm gonna keep on pumping them out there and i'll see y'all out there
stocked up on runs. Get up, guy. Pick that up. Right, right there. But people say they are delicious to eat. But we'll put them in the box. All right, guys, I'm hooked up. Hooked up on something, guys. Let it be something nice. Yes, yes. Yes. Lane snapper, guys. Check that out, Lane, right here. And awesome, never caught one of these out here before. Man, this has got to be eight inches, though. Never caught a lane. My first lane snapper out here at St. Mark's, Florida, guys. Got to be eight inches. Let's bring them to the measuring table. Let's get them checked out. Right there, guys. Eight and a half inches. Woo! I think I can cook that guy whole right there, guys. Clean them, gut them out. Cook them whole. Going in the pail, guys. Awesome lane snapper. St. Mark's out here. Living life, guys. Mm -hmm. Woo! to the house as you can see we had a wonderful day out there catching different kind of fish we call like I said we call catfish grunt we call blue runnels we call lane snapper lane snapper was an awesome fish never caught one before like that but it was awesome but that's into another video but to show you that give me just a second we have them right here the lane right there Man, it's not that big, but I got a big idea for it. So y'all stay tuned for that one. We'll be in another video. So we put them back for now. But the star of this show will be the catfish 
and this grunt. And I'm gonna pad it up in a whole different way that you've never seen before. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna fillet this one. I'm gonna just scale this. Also, if you've never tried with the spoon, try it with a spoon. Also way to clean up the scales. So I'm gonna scale this one, I'm gonna fillet this one, and I'm gonna take the meat and I'm gonna blacken it. I'm gonna blacken this meat and watch, you'll see. And I'm gonna make some blackened egg rolls. see me use in many videos this is the cast king right here and man that when I tell you this thing is super sharp you see me how I was just cruising along cutting through the fish like butter these things right here are sharp if you haven't tried one you need to try one you don't know where to find one I'll leave all the information about this knife in the description below guys but right now let's get to it as you see we got them all cleaned up ready to go Small, you didn't get much out of that little guy, but like I say, it's gonna be perfect for what I'm doing with it tonight. And so the only thing I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna blacken them up and um, get all my ingredients together. And we'll start assembling with the egg rolls. So we're just gonna put on some olive oil cooking spray down on the bottom, keep everything nice and coated. And Bring out the game changer, guys. This right here, that magic seasoning blend, right here, guys. Black and red fish magic. This stuff right here is awesome. You'll try this on blackening, you'll love it. So, this is what we're gonna do. Just gonna hit it. You know, it don't be when you're blackening, you ain't got to be stingy with it. You know, just bring it on. Get as much of that flavor you're gonna need on there. So don't be stinging with it. You can put it on on there. All right, so we're gonna lay this down here. Just like that. Mm, lay it down just like that. All right. So right now, as you can see it, that is what we're working with. You just hit the other side. The same way. You so you ain't gotta be standing with it. And it's not gonna take long, you know, just a couple minutes on each side and these will be ready and then we'll 
get ready to assemble everything, put everything together. I know y'all can smell that. That blackening off that fish. Woo, I wish you were here, guys. I'll let you try one, but like I say, we're gonna get to it. We're gonna clean up our mess, and in a couple of minutes, we're gonna come back and we're gonna flip these in just a minute. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and get it for flip. Just like that right there. Ooh, shake that out. That's what you're looking for right there. That is what, see that? That's what you're looking for right there. Come on in there. Turn my little baby over right there. Can you get a flip over too? Come on, you can draw on the party. All right, that is what you're looking for right there. Yeah, that's how good that look, guys. Y'all already see where I'm going with it, right? All right, guys, we're getting close. We're gonna be taking these off in a minute, but in the meanwhile, we're gonna have a half a cup of this basmati rice going in here, and we're gonna incorporate that in our egg rolls. So, like I say, just a, just a half a cup, and um, we'll put it in here and let it cook until it gets done. I'll be taking these off, and so, y'all stay with me. All right, guys, right here, I am took my blackened fish off. Right here. Look at that, guys. Check that out. We're ready to eat that right now, but we gotta wait. And I'm gonna set that to the side. And what I did, I'm gonna put a little garlic in here, about that much. And I went ahead and chopped up some mushrooms that I'm gonna put in here. So, just slide some mushrooms right in there. I'm gonna just go to sear these up. Oh man. This will be so good, guys. Yeah, just like that. I'm gonna come caramelize and I'm gonna take those off while my rice cooking right there. Already the same flavor, guys. All the flavors just come together. Come together. All right, guys, we're gonna make some of this secret sauce for y'all. And don't forget it's a secret, but I'm gonna share it with y'all. This stuff right here is good. Right here, it's called the Goya salsa right here. And some of the Russian sh -sh shower sauce. Everybody always throw it out, say it a hundred different ways, but that is the Russian sh -sh shower sauce right there, guys. And we're gonna put some brown sugar right there. Probably looking at me crazy, like what are these, what kind of sauce you're making, but I guarantee you try it, it is good. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go down with some of this sauce here. About that much. About that much. Right there. I'm taking some of your Russian sh -sh 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 sour sauce right here, guys. About that much. Mm-hmm. Just get out a small blend right there. It'll be for that dipping sauce for them egg rolls, guys. And I'm telling you, it's gonna be good. Thank you, some of your brown sugar. About two tablespoons of your brown sugar. You know, just like that. Mm-hmm. Put that in there, guys. And this right here is what you're left with. There it is. You get a little touch right there. Woo! There it is. There it is. It's ready. I'm gonna sit that to the side. Right there. And our rice getting ready. It's coming together. What we're gonna do. Got the star of the show right here. So we go get everything ready to go. When the rice come out, we go start putting everything together, guys. Uh, I think maybe, maybe a little bit more. Okay. I think that'll 
gonna be enough of the carrots. And then I'm gonna clean the mess up here. As you can see, I have my carrots all shaved and ready here. So I'm gonna set that to the side. And I'm gonna be using an egg right here. I'm just gonna crack it and stir it up. And that gonna be just to bind my egg roll edges together. So that is what my egg is gonna be for. But here, I have some green onion here that I'm gonna chop up real small. And I also have some basil on me, chopping up as well. And man, when I, from my own homegrown garden, this basil came from. And as soon as you take it loose, it just, whew, you smell it. So we're gonna roll this up like this right here. And we're just gonna cut it up the same way. And like I say, guys, this knife is sharp. If you haven't tried it, go try you one of these cast kings. You won't be disappointed. Cause this knife is sharp, sharp. All right, we got our herb ready. Okay. All right, and here's my egg right here. I'm just gonna crack it. Put it in there. That is for the binding process. Get on up and then there you go, just like that. fish egg rolls guys going in got the grease already hot and ready 350 degrees we're going in guys all right we'll let those cook about three to five minutes and they should be ready and we'll be showing y'all the finished product in just a minute. I'd like to say, guys, it was so awesome. I had so much fun today out there, and I can't wait to try these. I know they're gonna be delicious. Just a different way of trying to fish. And we did another video I did a while back with a catfish, you know, for sale cat, and versus the redfish. You can go back and check that in one of my videos. We did a comparison, and it was awesome. But we want to do the same thing here with that hard head and the grunt. And we think, you know, a lot of people throw them back, but we like to try them different ways. So in a minute, we're gonna show y'all how they taste and what our take on it. So give us just a minute. All right, guys, here it is. The finished product right here. So some of this egg roll, guys. Check it out. The secret sauce. 
Alright guys, check it out. Check it out guys. You already know it's gonna be good. Mm-hmm. Let me go ahead and bust one over for you guys. If y'all see what I'm talking about. Right here guys. Mm. Set that to the side. Check that out guys. Check that out. Blackened fish egg roll, guys. I'm gonna try one without the sauce. And then I'm gonna go in with the sauce, but I'm gonna try one first without the sauce, guys. Yeah, that's money right there, guys. That's money right there. That is, that's awesome. This right here. It's the hard head cat, the firm, and it is delicious, guys. This is delicious. So I'm going in with some of this sauce. A little bit more of that. Yes, yes, excellent. Yes, I'm glad I've done this. I'm glad I tried this, guys. Cause this is delicious right here. Who would think with a catfish that you would get down like that with a catfish, guys? I wish y'all were here to try it. Cause y'all can give me y'all honest opinions. I'm giving you mine. This is delicious. This is good. A different way of trying things, just outside the box thinking, but it's good. You just have to get out there and try it. You know. Try it for yourself, but like I say, this is delicious. I'm not just sitting him telling you this is good this way. You hear that crunk? Uh huh. Oh yeah, this is good. All right, guys. We, next, we're gonna be getting in with the grunt, guys. We're gonna try the grunt. We're gonna get in there with that grunt, guys. Same thing. White flaky fish without the sauce. This is the grunt, guys. Go on in. Flaky white fish, a good, great texture on it. I'm gonna try some of the sauce. Yeah. God, this sauce is a game changer. I'm telling you, you got to try this sauce. But this grunt is also delicious. Like I say, guys, if y'all haven't tried this, this is a different way of doing it. I never had a fish inside an egg roll before. But guys, I'm gonna tell you, this is a fun way of doing it. Great taste of fish right here, the grunt and the hard nose, they are great fish. Being out on the water, making these videos, getting the love and support from y'all. If y'all happen to subscribe to this channel, subscribe, hit that like, subscribe button, you know, I'd like to see more videos, I'd like to see me do more things, just let me know. Leave it in the comments in the description box below. Positive comments, guys. And like always, I'll see y'all out there.